My name is Paul Jonathan. Um, I'm a software developer and I work for Future Technologies Limited. Well, Future Technologies mainly deals with ERPs. ERPs are manage, uh, a management system. So basically, we build management systems uh, in terms of software, and our software is basically uh, URL based. When I say URL based, I mean you can access it using your URLs in your computer. In other words, it's a web based application. Uh, it started in 1995. But, but it later came, uh, became more popular in 1999. Feature technology started in the time when, uh, one, technology was being introduced in Uganda. And you find out that uh, these days, what brings up technology is the gap between uh, functionality and the gap between how do you deliver services. And uh, at that particular time, we are trying to look for better ways to enhance management systems. Uh, we are trying to avoid disruption of management system, of dis uh, disruptions of flowcharts. So we end up finding out that feature technologies came in the place where um, we are trying to limit all paperwork. Because first of all, the man management systems limits paperwork and also limits uh, usage of a lot of resources. Because I mean, you're accessing one system and you're, you're just uh, you're accessing one system at a go, preventing, preventing you from having different departments that will lead you to various activities. We tend so much to measure in um, management systems such as procurement management systems, assets management systems, hospital management systems, uh, and of late we are venturing into hybrid learning, building systems where students and uh, big colleges and universities can access these systems. And the difference between our, our hybrid learning system and others is that everything is incorporated in the system. You don't need to have another maybe Zoom link somewhere or e-library attached. Everything is accessed in the system. So we tend to prioritize our cloud computing or cloud engineering in our system. We are solving the bridge of work between workers and easing their work. There's a way it is so complicated doing paperwork in office compared to when you have all the system uh, that can do it for you. Because I mean, uh, for example, let us talk about HR management system. We have payroll. And this payroll, imagine all the tasks that one will do in terms of paperwork and relating now to it to the system where the system basically is going to do everything for you. You just fit in the details of the employee and what the employee is supposed to get and all the calculations are done for you in the system. So at the end of the day, employees are able to be they're able to be paid without you inter, uh, tending to have a lot of paperwork or a lot of calculations or all the deductions. All that is done in the system.